G'day, I'm Murray, this is my backyard, and it's time for another upgrade to the bird bath. I've had this in mind for quite a while, and the parts have finally arrived. So, yes, it's, there's going to be a significant change around here, hopefully, and hopefully it's going to work. This is an old ray candle, which I replace. So what I want to do now is to thin down the ends. So I thought I'd done everything right. I bought some 25 millimeter. These go in wood ropes and hold a cross beam across. These are 25 mil, and this is a brand new 25 mil rake handle. No, it's not. So I was going to use a new rake handle, but it turns out the old rake handle is a little bit thinner than the new rake handles. Those are about 30 mil. The old rake handle is 28, so I want these to go in here and wedge a bit and then not turn. I may have to dress these again, we'll see, but I really don't want them turning. On with the plan. Oh, that was easy. Is that a bit better? Yeah, that's more symmetrical. So my initial thoughts are that the plan is a good one. It'll be easy to disassemble when we go to mow around here. I'm not thrilled about the height, but we'll see how the birds use it. I've got a couple of options on the height. I can get a few longer pieces of wood over there, or I can cut a few inches off this one here. Doesn't really matter. Hmm, we'll see which way it goes. So that's the setup. Move a log and the piece of wood falls down and you can just set it back up when you want to and yeah, it's all good. Now, if you wanted to, if the logs start to turn, I could always drill a hole through here and put a single screw in, and that should hold the entire length in place. But I really don't want to do that. I'd rather have something that can just be popped apart. 
Well, that went pretty smoothly. Got everything done. It's all in place. So we'll keep an eye on how it operates and see if there's any problems. And I hope to see you in the next video. Have a good one.